classic example of these maps is what's called the Pinkerton World Map, which was drawn in the year 1818, and it was based on the latest navigational information at that time. What's missing from the map, entirely missing, is Antarctica. There's just a hole at the bottom of the world. There's nothing there. Reason, the reason that Antarctica is not there is that our civilization hadn't discovered Antarctica in 1818. Oh. So they couldn't authentically put it on a map in 1818. Actually, we discovered it in 1819, and that's when it starts appearing on modern maps. Problem is that Antarctica rep appears repeatedly on these much older maps, and it appears in the right place. And a bit bigger than it is today, but very much as it looked during the last ice age. So what all of this suggests to me is that the world was mapped and explored by a global seafaring culture with a level of technology that was at least equivalent to ours at the end of the 18th century during the ice age.